who did you keep in mind as the target audience of the book? So I, I have a philosophy here, which was helpful to my blog in general, which is I want the general public to be able to get something out of, like, I think the best artifact of writing or explanation, if somebody comes in and they know nothing about the topic, they can get something out of it. It just elevates their learning a little bit. I wrote a, a paper at an ICLR workshop that talks a little bit about this, about, about communication, about technical communication and scientific communication. And that definitely applies to them. So I think the general public in general would be able to get the intuitions of how does this model work? What is, you know, it's not just a black box, it's a tokenizer, then, you know, a series of transformer blocks and then a language model. And this is what they work, how they work. And this is the process that they work under. So we targeted the most accessible category, but the core audience is software developers. So if you know a little bit of Python, you'll be able to run through all of the code examples and get the most out of the book and go into the deeper topics with things like fine tuning, which I don't think the majority of people need to go into fine tuning, but if you want to take it to that level, which also includes researchers. So, you know, working in the field, you will see that there's credible computer vision researchers that maybe this is the first time they work with a transform. And so they need an accessible way to sort of learn the various components of this model. And so they 